Hey everyone, today we're taking a look at lens change systems, specifically the three best lens change systems out there on current masks. Uh, if you haven't checked out our video on the three worst lens change systems and you want to watch me die a little inside, be sure to check that out. It's uh, It was frustrating to make, so please watch it. Uh, but anyway, we're going to show you the best ones now, which should be a lot more fun. And with number three, I'm going to start with the Push Unite mask. Now this is a super easy lens change system. Um, and I'm just gonna get right in and show you it. So essentially what you wanna do, you have these two locky things where the strap essentially attaches to the body of the mask. You wanna actually get your finger in underneath the strap. So if you have to like feed the strap through a little bit, it'll probably make it easier. Once you've got your finger underneath the strap by the gray plastic lock, if you just pull out, yeah, you can just essentially pry it out just like that. So you see the gray plastic lock is out. And at this point, you're gonna push the strap forward and then that just pops off like that. So there you go. That's one side done. There we go. So I got both the locks off. Now you're just gonna push on the little fingers. There you go. Just pops right out like that and do what you gotta do. Clean it, change it, whatever reason you had for taking the lens out to put it back in. Super, super easy. One thing you may find is lining it up and sort of aligning the nose first will make it easier. So rather than do it from one side to another side, center it, get the nose in there, then they click into place. Once you've got the uh, lens actually in place, you're gonna take the black plastic lock, you're going to feed it over the part of the lens that actually sticks through. And this part is important. You wanna pinch it closed. So you essentially wanna push that black plastic lock towards, you just pinch it into the actual lens itself and then just pull back on the strap as you could probably hear clicks right into place once that's in place you take your i apologize it's going to be fiddly and hard to see take your gray plastic lock and you're essentially you want to basically feed it in like this i know that's a weird description but it's got a little locking tab on it and you want to feed that in first and then once you've got that in just presses right into place, just like that. So like super, super easy, not a big deal at all. You just wanna make sure everything's properly in place and then that way, nothing pops out on you. So yeah, there you go, not bad at all. Uh, like I said, this is a brand new mask, so it is a little bit stickier than normal, but like I've seen people do this in like 30 seconds. It's very, very fast. Moving on. We got the Virtue Vio. So this is a different system, but still very, very easy. Uh, again, kind of hard to see with these angles, but like, I'm gonna do my best. What you have here, you're also gonna work with, I mean, they're always the same, basically. It's the attachment point is wherever the strap and the lens kind of meet. But what you're gonna do is, you're gonna grab this part that the, the strap comes out of, and you're actually gonna push it forward. And then there's a little, Y-shaped tab that while you push it forward, press down on the Y-shaped tab. And then once that's pressed down, pull back, and it's just gonna pop out like that. And you're gonna do that on both sides. So you push it forward, press down, pops out like that. Then you got two hinges. They're just gonna pop forward. There you go. There you go. Pops right out like that. Do what you gotta do. Clean it, change it, clean it, whatever. I don't know why you're taking your lenses out. I'm sure you got a good reason. Let's put it back in, center it up, feed it in, make sure it's sitting nicely. Push the hinges back into place and then super easy, you're gonna take your strap, feed it back into the slot, push it all the way forward and then pull back on it. That's gonna lock it into place. You'll know it's in there because you can pull real hard on it and it's not going to go anywhere so yeah there you go again brand new mask so a little bit sticky but with practice you can get that so 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 fast the final is top easiest best lens change ever and i'm sure this is going to come as no surprise to anybody die i4 obviously it's got the best lens change if you disagree with me what's wrong with you um i will show you in case you're unfamiliar with it but it is just so nice uh you have these little plastic tabs, again, that essentially attach the strap to where the lens is. You're gonna push down on that plastic tab, and then you're gonna push forward on the strap. I'm gonna do it on the other side. Push forward. Lens just 
pops out like that. Super, super easy. Do what you gotta do. Feed it back in. Make sure it's, oops. Make sure it's centered. Then you're gonna grab that ear pad. You're gonna push the little hook into the hole in the lens, and then you're just gonna pull back on the ear pad. You'll hear it click into place. Do it to the other side. And there you go. That's it. So again, with practice, this is like a, this is like a 10 second lens change if you're good at it. So easy, no little fiddly plastic bits that fall out and can get lost. It's just like the quickest, easiest lens change ever. Um, but yeah, what do you guys think? Do you have something else? Do you have any ideas that should be on this list and maybe aren't? Like, are there masks that have an easier lens change system than an i4? Because if so, I've never seen it and I would love to know about it. Uh, leave your comments down below, like and subscribe, hit the buttons. Thanks for watching.